Hey everyone, this is uh, LDS Reliance. Um, today I wanted to do a, uh, a review of a product. Um, this is a uh, table saw that I picked up. Um, this is sold at Lowe's. It's a Porter Cable. Um, the model number is PCB220TS. Um, it's, uh, it's under $300. It's a, a contractor's table saw. Kind of a, uh, it's not a, quite a bench top. It's got a, a table, as you see there. Um, kind of more mobile, a um, little bit lighter weight, but uh, still should uh, produce some fairly reliable cuts. Now, the reason I'm doing a review of this is um, my philosophy is that, um, you know, part of being self-reliant or prepper or whatever is to have the right tools for the job, to be able to do a variety of tasks on your own instead of relying on other people to do that. So, um, you know, there's all kinds of uh, applications you can use for, for various tools to do around the house without having to call a handyman or a repairman or a carpenter or whatever to, to do those. So, you know, this will allow me, I'm, I'm in the process of building a shed, this will also allow me to replace my fence someday um, and do a variety of tasks, uh, building some furniture and things like that that, uh, that I'd like to do. So, anyway, I'm going to put this thing together. This is how it, it comes out of the box. I had to... Um, this is how I had to stuff it all in my car because the box was a little bit too fit, too big to fit. Um, this is the uh, how the, uh, the table, a mobile stand thing comes, uh, and then this is uh, upside down, but it's the the main saw part. And then <clears throat> here's the fence and some of the accessories. So I'm going to go ahead and put this thing together and give it a shot, and then uh, finish up this review. Okay, I'm back. Um, here you see the uh, table saw completely assembled. Um, now I haven't um, made any fine adjustments or or dialed this thing in yet, nor have I turned it on yet. But um, this uh, took less than an hour to put together. Um, the uh, the stand went together really fast. The tabletop just kind of bolts to the to the uh, or the the saw part just kind of bolts to the the stand and then probably the longest time was putting all the accessories in their places and bolting all that up and uh, mounting the saw and uh, putting the extension um, bar on the back so um, I'm pretty impressed the instructions were very easy to follow um, and it's, uh, it seems like a quality piece um, obviously I won't know how well it performs until I try it out I think I'm gonna put that in a different video. Um, also, one note, I think I put my foot in my mouth. I'm not sure quite exactly that this is a contractor saw. Um, it does seem to be of a higher durability level than the, the, you know, the skill saws and stuff that are on the lower end, but, uh, but it, it looks like, uh, based on the way this thing went together, it's basically just a bench top saw that's just on a stand. So, <clears throat> There is a lot of aluminum and plastic on this thing uh, to make it light and portable and cheaper. Um, so take that for what it's worth. That's definitely gonna cut down on the, uh, the durability and the, uh, the accuracy potentially. But uh, I think all in all, this is gonna be a good, um, <clears throat> a good compromise uh, piece. So uh, stay tuned and I will review how it performs. Thanks.